Hey guys, what's up? It's Louis, and uh, welcome back to another Road to Panda video. Uh, I believe this is number six. Yeah, it's number six. Play, play some domination. And um, yeah, last episode I was just talking about uh, views on like uh, sport and uh, and this game that people have been playing at my school, which was pretty freaking funny. Um, today, what I wanted to talk about was. Uh, Oh my god, I just had something really good in mind to talk about. Um, sorry about this, guys. I It actually literally just left my line. I was actually thinking about it like five seconds ago. Um, um, oh yeah, I remember now. Alright, sorry guys, that was kind of dumb. But, um... Yeah, I, c I just wrote it down somewhere, but I just need to go find a piece of paper. But, um, yeah, sorry about that. But, yeah, what I wanted to talk about was actually, um, mistakes that I've, pretty big mistakes that I've made in my life. Probably, like, some of the bigger ones and, you know, stuff like that. Um, so, yeah, first off, um, the, probably the, probably the biggest mistake that I've made that has made me feel pretty bad was I was over at my friend's house, who is Kai or Clutches. He's the one that uh, he's the one that I'm gonna do that dual combo with about the story, which we haven't gotten around to doing yet, cause we just haven't really had much time. But um, yeah, pretty much what happened was he um, me and him. This was like a few years ago when I was about maybe 11 or 12. So this was like three years ago, three four years ago or something. Um, yeah, pretty much what happened, I was over at his house, just, I think it was like a few days before Christmas, it might have been like five, six days before Christmas, one happy year, and, uh, what happened was, his dad, he says he doesn't smoke, but like, he kind of does like once every three weeks or something, so he's not like too addicted to it, but, you know, but, um, and it's just a cigarette, it's like weed or some shit, but Kai reckons he does anyway, but, um, crap. I just want a helicopter thing going over me. And I want to get its care packages. Oh wait, where are they? Over there. Shit. Get this one. Fuck. Anyway, yeah, so his dad kind of smokes. So we found some of his lighters that he has. And that was a really weird lag. We found, like, a lighter that he has, right? And we were just, like, mucking around. And, like, lighting random shit, like, in, like, the sink. And then we went into his brother's room, and, uh, you know, he had, like, a bit of paper on the table. So I decided to, like, you know, just light the corner of it a bit. Just, you know, a bit of a laugh. And then I made sure I blew it out and everything. It was all, like, you know, no red spark things anymore. But then, actually, we were downstairs watching a movie. And, uh, like, me and then, like, his brother, and I think it was his dad. Um... And we were like, I oh know, and someone was like, can you smell smoke? And, uh, me and Kai were like, uh, no, because, like, we couldn't really smell anything. So we went upstairs kind of find the source of this random smoke. And I, by that time, I had some idea that it could have something to do with what happened with us. Whoa, that was weird. What happened with us when we were just, you know, mucking around, having a bit of a laugh. Um... And what actually turned out happened, it was, the house was actually, I'm not going to lie, it could have burnt down if I hadn't blown it out, like, a tiny bit more. Oh, freaking Dead Man Sand is so gay. If I hadn't blown it out a tiny bit more, um, it actually wouldn't, um, it actually probably wouldn't have just burnt a piece of paper, but probably would have maybe burnt a bit of his desk or something like that before we actually smelt it and went and put it out. But, uh, yeah, pretty much the whole piece of paper that I had lit in the edge of was oh my god I hate knives oh wow I'm doing so shit the piece of paper was actually um oh fuck the piece of paper the whole thing had just pretty much disappeared there wasn't really much left of it it was just all black ash on his table and so what happened was they called actually the fire brigade before, sorry, before they found a piece of paper, they called the fire brigade, 
they thought it might have been some electrical fire and electrical wires like you know up in the roof so they called the fire brigade they were actually on their way over to the house and um oh damn yeah they actually were on their way over to the house to like put out this fire but um yeah as it turns out they found a piece of paper that was kind of burnt and uh And, uh, yeah, they pretty much just caught up fiber. I cancelled the, uh, thingy, the, the truck thing to come. And, uh, yeah, what happened after that was the next day, um, oh, they actually told me to go home because they couldn't find, like, because they just, yeah, something had burnt down, like the piece of paper hadn't burnt down, but you know what I mean. They actually told me to, like, you know, just go home. So I pretty much sprinted off to my family who were actually having drinks at a friend's house, like family friend's house, not too far away. And uh, yeah, they uh, pretty much, um, I just ran home. I was feeling really freaked out because I had no idea what was going to happen. I thought I was going to get heaps of trouble by like, the police or some shit. Um, so yeah, that freaked me out like crazy. But um, as it turned out, the next day or a couple of days after, we got a call from them. This guy's like my, probably one of my best friends. We got a call from their family and it was like, can you come over? Um, we want to talk about what happened the other day. So I went over and uh, I was trying really hard to like, you know, I didn't actually, at the beginning, I didn't tell the truth. I was like, oh yeah, we were just like mucking around and we like chucked it in the sink. And I don't like. I don't think it could have been us because we like were doing it in the uh, in the bathroom, in the sink. We were just you know mucking around with it. Um. So yeah, that's probably one of the main things that I feel bad about actually not telling the truth in the beginning. But yeah, not much I can do about that and now. Um. I have learnt from my mistake. That's all I can really say. And also um. Yeah. And so I was like, yeah, we just like chucked it in the sink. Um. Yeah, and at that time I was like pretty much trying to stay cool, you know, not like act suspicious or anything. And um, and then I actually ended up telling him that I had uh actually uh we had been in his room and I had actually lit the corner of the piece of paper, but uh, is that thing? Oh, good. Yeah, that I had actually lit the corner. Oh, let's go. That I had actually lit the corner of the paper, but I had made sure that I'd blown out and everything, just in case, because that's what you do when something like that happens. Oh, and it, what ended up happening was um, I was like, yeah, and then we chucked it across the room, and uh, like I just chucked a light across the room, and it must have somehow stayed alight and like lit the paper or some shit. I made up all this retarded stories that didn't even make sense because I was just didn't want to get in trouble as you do when you're like 10 or 11 or something. And so I made up all these retarded, retarded like, you know, stories. There we go. Um, yeah, I made up all these random stories about what was happening, what could have happened. In the end, I told them the truth. And um, it actually wasn't, you know, wasn't actually that bad of, um, you know, like, a punishment. I just couldn't, like, come over to his house for, like, a week or something, and we had to help his dad out in, like, you know, the garden or something like that. You know, go, like, mow the lawn, like, clean the house or something for, like, a day. But, yeah, we didn't actually end up doing that. He kind of forgot. So, um, yeah, the punishment wasn't too bad. But, um, yeah, and, uh, well, Sorry guys. Um, and I think that yeah, the game's finished. So um, thanks, thank, wow, that was really shit score. I promise it'll be better the next time. I've got a really good uh thing lined up for the best guns, and it's gonna be the P90. But yeah, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you later.